Welcome to another episode of Between Two Trucks. I'm your host with the most, Barney, the roofing guy. I have a special guest today, Robert Boz Bosley. Welcome. Thank you. Um, to let my viewers know, we call him Bosley for short. He is our safety director. Tell a little uh, about yourself and your position here at West Roofing as a safety director. Been the safety director here since 2008. Uh, took over for Mike West. Um, before that, I've been with the company quite a few years before that. Uh, I've done almost every job there is to do with the company, but uh, can't seem to ditch this safety director position. Jack of all trades, master of none. Yeah, I, I get it. Probably get so, it. yes. Yeah. So today we're going to talk a little bit about safety. Um, Try not to bore our viewers too much. You know, safety is sometimes boring, but it's very important in West Germany, correct? It is. That's our culture, right? Yes, it has to be. So some of the things that we're going to talk about are some of the things that we use on the job site every day, like PPE. A lot of people don't know what PPE means. You know, ergo PPE, uh, you know, something like that. We don't know, you know. Explain what PPE is. Uh, PPE is uh, personal protective uh, equipment. It is hard hats, glasses, gloves, many different types of gloves. The stuff respirators. you always got to constantly yell at the guys about because they're not wearing. The guys, I, what I you have know. to yell at the guys about because they're not wearing or they lose. Absolutely. It's like having 50 kids, isn't it? Yeah, 50 is a good number. Give or take. Right now. Give or take. We're hitting the summer months, you know, hydration. How important that is that with these guys? I mean, let's say, you know, it's like giving them a cup of coffee. Good on a summer day? No, it's not. Caffeine, uh, anything with caffeine in it, pop, coffee, tea, cold stuff beer? like that. Cold beer? Cold beer is also not a good thing for, uh, for maybe after work, but at a minimum. And you don't want to drink heavy uh, the night before you're going to have a hot day because it actually depletes the water in your system. Yeah, that don't make them tough anymore, do they? So is sunscreen important out there in the sun? I mean, besides trying to get a suntan, I know these guys prefer to try to take their shirts off and try to have a suntan. Is it important for sunscreen out in these hot days in the summer? It is, especially if you're uh, fair skinned. You always need to uh, have sunscreen available. The guys need to use it, keep it off of them with the UV rays. Um, skin cancer is definitely something that we have in our industry and we need to protect our guys against it. So you take your job pretty seriously. I absolutely take my no, job. Just like me, so we're kind of like, I like that, I like that. Here's another one. Do you let your roofers wear sandals? <laughs> no. Why not? No. Because they, they need to have, uh, we uh, definitely suggest that they wear work boots. I know these are look like tennis shoes, but they are composite toe shoes. They need to protect their feet. I actually, when I was working in the field, had a drum fall on my foot. Another guy dropped it on there and that did not have steel toes or composite toe on there. I had a limp for quite a while. Robert Bosley Limpy. You got a lot of nicknames. Well, since you said that, what, what I want to suggest this at the next uh, safety meeting is... Steel toed sandals? Yeah, why not? I don't think it's a good idea. You just said composite toe, didn't you? They are composite toe, but I still don't think it's a good idea. It could hurt the, That'd be perfect it hurt the other day. parts of the feet. You gotta make them guys happy, that would be one. You know what, we got guys that would wear them. I know. <laughs> so I know one of the biggest factors in roofing, and we deal with it on a daily basis, is fall protection. Absolutely. You know, there's times I go up on a roof, guy pisses me off, I wanna make him fall. Is that, is that a safety? That's a safety issue, yeah. Why? You can't You can't make somebody you fall know. off a roof. We don't want anybody to go off a roof. Just check it. I see a lot of times it's stressful for a person like you trying to deal with every day safety and trying to get these guys to do the right thing. But I do want to congratulate you. You finally, we hit a milestone just a week ago. Congratulations, 365 days without incident. Tell us a little bit about that. It was good to, uh, good to get there. It was uh, 365 days without a lost time injury. Definitely but yeah, work. 365, it was an exciting. Congratulations. Exciting Thanks. It's a heck of a milestone. Well, that concludes today's episode. I appreciate you wasting my time, Boz. I appreciate you showing up. And uh, appreciate everybody tuning in today, and uh, thank you.